Ole, 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 and welcome to All Your Living Needs. I'm Jono, your host, and now we're going to talk about Chicago Fire versus Columbus Crew. This game is taking place tonight at 8.30 p.m. August 2nd. Previous meetings saw Chicago won three and lost two. Season goal leaders include from the Chicago Fire, Harrison Ship with six goals, Quincy Amorkawa with six goals, Mike McGee with five goals, and Jeff Larentowski with four goals. From the Columbus Crew side, we've got Federico Higuen with seven goals, Ethan Finlay with five goals, and Benador Ano with four goals. The Chicago Fire have played 20 games, and Columbus Crew have played 20. Uh, 21, I'm sorry. Uh, Chicago Fire have won 3, lost 5, and drawn 12. The Columbus Crew have won 6, lost 7, and drawn 8. So, Chicago Fire, Wednesday they tied 0-0 against Vancouver Whitecaps but showed a very, very weak defense as Vancouver had control of the ball most of the game and just wasn't able to put it in, which is partially a testament to Chicago Fire's goalkeeper, but also just a case of bad luck when it came to uh, Vancouver. Report uh, Disciplinary report, no one is on the disciplinary report, no one is on the disabled list for the Chicago Fire. However, they are eighth in the Eastern Conference. Against Columbus Crew, they won against uh, New England last Saturday, 2-1 to one in a solid performance. This is what I like to see in a team. When team members work together, they get things done. Of course, the fact that they looked like a bunch of bananas on the field uh, is more of a question of what their fashion and style sense is than their gameplay. Disciplinary report, uh, Ch uh, T. Chayanne uh, and Trap are one caution away from a suspension. Disabled list, we have midfielder Hector Jimenez uh, with a right metacarpal sprain. Uh, midfielder Kingsley Fifi uh, Bedin with a groin hip strain. Uh, Matt Wheat with a left ACL reconstruction. So he'll be out for a long time on that. And defender uh, Josh Williams with a, left, with a groin strain. They're number five on the Eastern Conference. So the predictions here for this game, uh, here we have a team on one side uh, that are on the edge of success. They're number five spot. They have the ability to move up. And on the other side, you have Chicago Fire. They're hoping just not to fall off into obscurity. However, I don't see this as Chicago's game tonight, as Columbus has just proven to be a solid team working together. They're getting stronger, and Colum and uh, the other Chicago uh, just seems to be uh, falling apart a little bit. So my final predictions are that this is going to be for the Columbus crew. Sorry, I didn't write this out before, but we're going with three to one. Columbus Crew. That's what I gotta say. Hey, uh, don't forget to subscribe, like, share, comment, everything. Don't forget about the contest. Uh, we got a great contest. Winner pair of cleats, your cleats, what you want. Uh, and ole, ole, ole. Have a happy and safe weekend. Uh, keep dry. There's a lot of rain on the U.S. forecast. Cheers. Thanks so much for watching.